Hello everyone, welcome to a new series of NTO, or the new order the last days of Europe. And y'all heard me say that I'd have a new series, um, yes, and y'all heard me, I'd say I'd play Austria and Der Bundeskrieg. I'd have a new series, uh, on a completely different game, and, um, actually I think that's it. Oh, as I did promise, Oculus Gameplay. Uh, we're not going to be doing Austria, because, um, the mod kind of broke for me, and I don't know why. Um, we will still be having the, uh, new game series. Um, and want to let you guys know which that is. is. It is an old game I used to play a lot whenever I was younger. Um, Alien vs. Predator. Well, the game from 2010, I think. So, a 12-year-old game. But, we're gonna get into the new order, the last day of Europe. And then, I'll, 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 like you guys, I don't know when I'm gonna, you know, actually get that. But, it's gonna be hopefully sometime. Wait, they have a credits in this one? New order, the, <laughs> that's funny. And we're gonna be a single player, I've never played this mod. Okay. Let's read this. With the triumph of the Axis over the Allied powers, a new order has descended upon the world. In the places of the Union Jack and the and the Hammer and Sickle now soar the rising sun and a demonetization word. Um, a single light flickers um, desperately against the night in the United States. Germany celebrates. The first man on the moon, as European sh chaffs in the Japanese line, its pockets in China slumber slowly breaks. The Mediterranean lies on the knife's edge, and what remains of the Rus Russia prepares to realize its destiny. Let's see that. Okay, so we have a lot of things here. So we have Scotland, and uh, obviously the United States, Richard, Richard Nixon. Huh. Okay, so then you have the Axis, which is obviously Hitler, the Kingdom of England, Ireland, surprisingly. Uh, whatever this is, Austrian, Burgundy, Reichs, Kumasari, Africa, and whatnot. And then you have West, and then I think these are all just like breakaway states in Russia and Puna. And then you have Japan. The Japan is probably an interesting one with the Republic of China, India, uh, India, Indonesia, and the Lenhan, and then you have the Iberian Union in Italy, which is actually not led by Mussolini, surprisingly, but in this new series, I don't know who we're going to be playing as, but for my standards, we, where's France? Um... Maybe I'll play as France. I don't know who I'm going to play as, but, um, exactly, but for now, I think we're actually going to play as, uh, the Kingdom of England. Is there a French? Yeah, here it is, a French state. Okay, so here's the world in this timeline. Oh. Oh, this, that's cool. It uses, uh, DEF CONs for, um... How easy it is. I'm gonna do Defcon, Defcon 4. Not really that bad of a game. Oh, that's cool too. How it kind of goes from 0, 4, 3, 2, 1. Yeah. So we're gonna be playing as England, and we're gonna see what happens here. Um, here are the interesting countries. We have main menu, load, and options right there. Uh, I think there's an economy system in this game, but I honestly don't know. But I, uh, here we go, I guess. Okay, so, um, like I said, I don't know much about this mod, it is, in, it's not relatively new, in my opinion, in, like, I, I've never played it, I just, I mean, I was gonna do a Thousand Week Reich series instead of this, but this kind of caught my attention, and I decided this would be a lot easier. Okay, so we have country info. Of the Englishmen and the rest of the world, what is there to say but that they invaded most of it at one point or another. Perhaps then it is 
inevitable that they would be subjected to the same deprivations they inflicted on thousands on a thousand nations at the hands of Germany. England and this new and un, un, untested area era is not the same place it was, as it once was. For instead of a traditional power structures, it lets loose a line for all those who want no more war with the Reich. The royal par, uh, party under Alec Douglas Holm, the party has recovered greatly from Mitchell's day of war and chaos following 1953. The London uprising by the communist revolutionaries ha Home leads the moderate faction of the RP. The largest portion of the coalition dedicated more to stability than any other true ideas beyond that. At this side, Harold Monka and his reformists, who formally adhere to their dem democratic principles but are willing to compromise with Home for good of England. Also, there are hardliners dedicated. Oh, jeez, this is long. Oh, Lord, this is long. Um. I think this is just kind of like a backstory here. But I'm just gonna read to the end of this paragraph here. Um, beyond that, it is hmm, we're normally added to democratic principles, but really for England. Also, hardline prisoner dedicated fascists led by Arthur Kenneth Quinchester. Whoever invokes to closer to the German model, despite the differences, all three of these groups have been wanting to work together for the sake of England's recovery. But recovery doesn't mean doesn't doesn't meant stability for one another faction exists with England. Um, and then we also region info, mod textures, and mod info. Okay, let's do tally ho. Okay, so Lord, um, ah, ah. Um, okay, um, this is different, um, so, oh, the House of Commons, we have, yes, here we are, Edward, 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 Edward. okay, uh, okay, so we have focus trees, tick-tock, tick-tock, um, uh, we have research slots. Let's. Whoa! 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 That's a lot of stuff. I think the red are stuff we haven't researched. Now let's work on that. And. Um. 60 that. And. Um. I'll do school construction. This is completely different. Okay. So we have. Um. I guess guns and whatnot. We. It is 1962, but we don't really have anything beyond 52. I guess that has something to do with us being a little puppet of the Germans. Let's see, support, support is, okay, and we have helicopters, tonk, um, we have the tonk, artillery, anti-air, I'm gonna focus on, I'm not, I don't really know what I'm doing, so don't, don't blame me. This is what I was scared of. <laughs> okay. Um, I think we just need to keep this down, this down, and this up, and this well, up, I guess. Um, economic warning size, negative real growth. Oh, we also have the Cold War diplomacy tensions. World tension currently six at sixty-two. So we're on DEFCON two. It looks like. Um, analyzing global conflicts. Ooh, that's cool. Scan complete. Display. Alright, so we have the Mongolian Civil War, the, um, and the, uh, looks like a little war between, so we have DEFCON 5, 4, 3, and it looks like we are at 2 right now with all these wars here. Um, but let's just look at the civil, the thing here. So, out of, out of this, like, huge cold wars, the nuclear- Oh, Lord! Jeez Louise, the amount of warheads. Okay, so it looks like, um, the, uh, Nazis are in first, and, uh, America's in second, and Japan is in third. Uh, GDP stage. It currently looks like America is in t at the top, 
And let's do tensions. Uh, American German tensions are a bit higher. Uh, these are to the max. Not surprising. These are a bit lower than I expected them to be, to be honest with you. And then these, I'm not surprised, are really low. And then we have rankings. So America, yet again, probably number one. Most likely going to be number one. Right, where was I at? Uh, Cold War. Construction. Oh, this is new, actually. Okay, I like the uh, little things, like you have state, like infrastructure, and then province. Right, but um, we're probably going to work on a bit of infrastructure here in London. Around London, the London areas here, and also a bit in Sussex, it looks like I'll do. Um, what's this? Oh, production units, that's cool. So we have production units, which... Oh, that's super cool. Um, okay, how do I close this? Right, now close it. Okay, close it. Uh, production, we are currently... We have no... Watch. Um, I... Okay, um, we'll just put all ten on you here. Um... And then we also have probably the same thing here. Okay. Um, we also have crew and display, logistics, intelligence, officer core, and then, un and then we have all the un unassigned divisions. Okay, so let's put them under general, um, I don't know, Enley Hug Barker. No, I'll do Jeffrey, Jeffrey Baker. He's probably not the best, but who knows. Okay, so we're going to do... Probably four speed for now, at least. Gosh, this is a bit slow. I thought it would. Um, okay, yeah, so you have Germans going. It looks like everywhere here. Okay, I. Whoa, what's this? Oh! Oh, if you click on their provinces, like a main province, like Germania or any of that, you actually get like a history of it. Um, kind of like here at London, I guess. Like, London. Here we are. London. Um, okay, so we have, uh, Parliament. This is Parliament. I want Edward in charge. Independence. I need the independence higher. Um, right now. Okay, we're doing TikTok here. We have troops doing whatnot. So, let me, uh, let me see here. And then the king's speech. No more preparation, Edward. Goes live. We will gain, uh, control decision menus. It doesn't look like, um, anything is that bad. Snape beneath their feet. The gears move. The big love almost there. Right, writing on the walls. I'll probably go down this path. Um, I, I want to do the king's speak. Oh, what's this? Free military factories. And then the missile crisis. The event will keep sitting on the edge of the sea for several months. Thank you to an end of today. The United States and Japan region are in the Hawaiian missile crisis. Good, okay, nice. Um, let's pull you guys back here. Um, this is all we have for infantry equipment. I guess I could just build civilian trains and... Mm, I don't know, an aircraft carrier, I guess? Not aircraft carriers, aircraft, I guess. I mean, I don't think we're probably going to be allowed to do much since we're Germany's... Puppet? So we got TikTok here. We're going to do TikTok. This video ain't going to be long. Uh, but the NTO series, I'll try to keep as long as I can, unless, like, you know, it kind of just falls apart. But we also have society development. Eh. Hey. 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 I don't... Is this where I go to, like, fix that stuff? So I guess if I move this up, this does get rid of a bit of my money. TikTok. 
Cooper and Rebel. Um, okay, so. The English and nation of compromise are very resistant, depending on the fact that the Germans consider is not worth the effort to help us like the Dutch were no Norwegians. Regardless, the same color of the man on the firm listening, enough factors across the channel. Superiority must. Our first priority must. The continued survival of England, above all else, the king may think he can claim recent tensions with the speech and proud work, but we know better. These tensions respect... Okay. And then we also have the statement beneath their feet. His Majesty the Royal... Most Royal Resistance catch all term for the... Including? Almost there, writing on the wall. I guess we should probably go down the Prime Minister here. Um, I don't I don't know what to do. Um, we have economy, which doesn't seem to be going well, so I'm going to move this to 100%. 0% of our GDP. Inflation is going to skyrocket. Um, um, We need this to go up, not down. I don't... We can't be, like, doing... We can't have inflation high. Like... Like, inflation is gonna take over the country. Um... Like, unless we just... Okay, we're gonna have to hire, um, inflation by... By the max, just to get some money. Reich's la the Reich's class con conquest. Um, the 19th of January, 1962, Anhar Kohler became the first man to ever ma land on the moon. While the space race has been struggling between the Reich, Japan, and the U.S., while the Americans have managed to put the first man in space, the further was probably not that Germany was running firmly plants the Reich as the victor in the competition. But the space race we won. Okay, we don't know. But I guess we could just um, end this first video here. I'm probably going to do this once every Saturday. So you'll see this next Saturday. If not, I'll probably be like a later date. But this will usually be every Saturday. And the new AVP series will be coming out as soon as I could get it out. So I hope you guys enjoyed the, the, the first new order video. Just me basically just checking out the stuff. But, uh... I hope you're doing. I hope you enjoyed, and uh, see ya.